Yes, you are saying this correctly. We are making a food tier list in the year 2020. Even though it's not relevant anymore, but who cares if you never ate in one of these, one of these freaking god dang places, you are lying. Let's go ahead and start this video, okay? Right now, I'm gonna be real, we are starting out pretty badly. We got Arby's as our number one, our first thing we gotta put on the list. This isn't looking too good. If you like Arby's, I honestly do not know what to say anymore. So, your boy is gonna have to put it at F. I never ate checkers before. Jack in the box, never been there. Jimmy John's, it's not bad. It's not extremely good. Jimmy John's, you got some good sandwiches. Put some bread, some cheese, some ham, some, some lettuce. I gotta give it a, I give it a, a C. I honestly have to give it a C. Sonic, nah, we're not talking about Sonic the Hedgehog. We're talking about Sonic. drive through action going on. But is the food good though? It's gonna have to go to the D tier. I never, I never heard of what a burger is, so I'm just gonna have to skip this. Okay, White Castle. After watching Harold and Kumar, I always wanted to go eat in White Castle. I did have them frozen White Castle burgers, but personally, I have to put it as never been. You can't compare frozen food to the real thing. I hope they got some small pancakes too. I must admit, those pancakes are small. I give it a C tier. You're probably gonna hate me later on in this video, but uh. <laughs> let's just keep on going papa john is solid pizza's not bad your boy gotta have to put it at it let's say i guess for quality that the pizza is pretty decent okay panda express i i got nothing else to say it's s tier i be eating there every week they got orange chicken they got them cream cheese ragoon and um the walnut shrimp beijing beef popeyes the really good thing about popeyes is the chicken sound besides that it's all right it's mediocre it's not i'm gonna have to put out a d tier little caesar's next little caesar's it's a c we gotta go to zaxby okay zaxby zaxby's pretty good gotta give it a b it's burger king okay burger king is kind of like the last option if you got mcdonald's I'm, I'm gonna have to give it a d tier wendy's b I'm gonna give it a B tier. 4 for 4 be having everything you need. Taco Bell is, in my opinion, it's definitely C tier. The little cinnamon bites too, that definitely puts it at a solid C spot. Subway, their quality, it's all right, but sometimes the bread be soggy. I can't, I can't do it dirty. I gotta put in a C tier. If I put Jimmy John's in C tier, I gotta put Subway in C tier. What, five guys? I'm gonna have to put it at Never Been. Applebee's, Auntie Annie, it's pretzels, C tier. Let's go ahead to go to Chili's. All right, let, let me tell you about this one time when I went to Chili's though. Okay, so I went to Chili's with my family, right? We, we stood there for five to 10 straight minutes. We didn't get any service. That's definitely gonna be a factor, but before that, I actually was served, and that was like a long time ago, and I the food was good. But I'm gonna have to give it out a T, D tier. The food is solid, it's really good, but that customer service, Chipotle S tier, I don't care what anybody says, it's S tier. Every day, 24 seven, Chipotle it's the way to go so denny's this is what i mean but i'm tell telling y'all y'all probably gonna hate me after this it's above ihop they have this little thing like four or five bucks where you can eat as much pancakes as you want domino's pizza where, where i put papa john's i put it a b tier i'm gonna put it right next to papa john's you can put almost anything on pizza but not pineapple you like pineapple on pizza uh just click off this video right now please cc's pizza i know a lot of people don't be liking cc's pizza but the fact that you can eat as much pizza as you want and there's like a whole bunch of varieties it's a b like i said they you can't go wrong with pizza parties never been in and out we don't have no in and out and over here bro kate capital fc kfc back then used to be smack kfc's i've been to i don't know what's going on i used to like kfc when i was younger it's not good no more buffalo wild wings never been there chick-fil-a is it s tier uh, mm, no nah, it's a tier it's a tier chick-fil-a is good if you want chicken go to chick-fil-a no you can't compare anything to chick-fil-a service panera bread let's just go ahead and put down a never been what the heck is this not never been a lilo barbecue long john silver i never had long john silver marco's pizza i never been here with mcdonald's the customer service is going to be doo-doo sometimes the ice cream machine probably never works mcdonald's is a mcdonald's is everywhere it don't matter where you are okay so we got dq you serve the ice cream and you're like you can hold it upside down and it won't fall off or something like that the blizzard that's all i remember the ice cream be kind of smacked though i'm gonna have to give it a d tier pizza hut i have a thing for pizza it's like if it's if it's pizza i'm gonna eat it pizza is always gonna be a, a b tier for me pizza is pizza 
but the thing about me i don't eat crust you guys do make sure like you know let me know it's like you have a whole pizza right you have all the sauces and ingredients on it but then at the end of it it's just a piece of bread starbucks is not bad starbucks coffee is kind of expensive it's a b tier steak and shake steak and shake is good but the service though it was a c but after i didn't get my chicken nuggets your boy got kind of sad it happened three times the crusty crap waffle house i say waffle house is a c it's different compared to ihop and denny's but if you're ever at a waffle house and you see people arguing you're at a waffle house so waffle house is somewhere you want to go when you want to see some action church chickens i can't judge it if i don't remember what the food tastes like friendlies isn't that the ice cream i'm gonna have to put put it down here johnny rockets nope never ate here before del taco no olive garden it's not bad you know you can probably go there once in a while red robins i've never been to red robins but i really do want to be go to red robins cracker barrel it's b tier they got some good food cracker barrel you you get you earn your place in b dave and busters never went to dave and busters no bob evans tim hortons nope on the border Krispy Kreme A tier. They're donuts. And you get Krispy Kreme donuts in the right time. Oh, that thing be soft as heck. But uh, um, Krispy Kreme, solid. A tier. Earned a spot. There's no denying that Krispy Kreme is A tier. Dunkin' Donuts, on the other hand. Right after Krispy Kreme? That's not fair. That's definitely not fair. Dunkin' Donuts is it's not bad. But Dunkin' Donuts, it's not the first place you really think of when you want to get donuts. Baskin Robbins. That's a classic. It's not like anything out of the ordinary. But ice cream is ice cream. If it's good it's good they got a whole bunch of flavors cabaros i've seen this before i just never been there okay if we're basing off the cheesecake factory based on the cheesecake you already know it's a tier but the food has anyone tried cheesecake factory food i had the cheesecake but not the food if it's about the cheesecake it's definitely a tier but the food beef O'Brady's. nah i never had this i think this is bonefish nah i never had bonefish grill el boyo loco this place always reminds me of that one shop in um what's it called breaking bad el boyo loco nope a and w all american food nah i never had a and w i thought it was just the root beer or well, i might be mistaken but something else but i never had a and w firehouse sub ate there once the food is good firehouse sub it's a c golden corral i got a soft spot for buffets i have to give golden corral a b sometimes the food be on point sometime it don't but at the same time you can eat as much as you want hungry howies it's c it's similar to the little caesars there's not much you can really talk about it but it's it's still pretty good hooters <laughs> you already know we don't go to hooters for the food you know what i'm saying but i uh, know nah, i never been to hooters i never been to hooters hope you put that put it on here cheddar scratch kitchen i never heard of that place crystals never had that man longhorn is it is good longhorn is a tier outback i'm gonna have to put it as never been red lobster is when you go with your family and you don't have to pay for it that's when red lobster is s tier but if you're going by yourself or with a friend or something you gotta pay nah red lobster is definitely an f tier in the price range by yourself definitely a lower but if we were to balance it it has to be b tier ruby tuesday a regular you know restaurant you got a salad bar and everything i i give it a c what is this texas i don't even know what it says i i don't know what this is well this this is my rating it is all over the place i only got two s tiers panda express and chipotle chick-fil-a was a close but yeah this is my definitive food tier list until i try all of these i definitely want to try white castle and in and out those are definitely some go-to places i really want to go to eat this is it this is everything you know <laughs> if there's anything that you know you disagree with me hey just let me know let your boy know tell him what he gotta do in order to enjoy the food but that's it i want to say appreciate you guys checking this out you know this is, this is a pretty long video you made it to the end that's what's up all right thanks for watching though